Hi, this is Linda. If you want to be sending a lot of these emails and you don't want to have to copy and paste from Word every time you do an email, then you may want to create a template in Outlook and I'm going to show you how easy that is. First thing we're going to do here is a little tweaking on our content. We're going to get rid of the subject line and the dear so and so. And for the rep name and rep number, I'm going to hit, I'm going to highlight it and I'm going to hit the enter key. I'm going to put my mouse back where it used to be. Then I'm going to go up to the insert tab. I am going to choose picture. And then I'm going to put my snazzy email signature in there. All right, looking good. Now we're going to go up to where the C is and congratulations. We're going to click our mouse and we're going to hold it and drag it all the way to the bottom. And then we're going to go up and hit the copy button. All right. Now we're done with Word, we're going to minimize it. Now we're going to create our template. So the first thing we need to do is hit the new email button. And it's not really called template, it's called a signature in Outlook. Don't know why, just is. So when you click the signature button, you can see there's a drop down menu at the very, very bottom. It says signatures. That's where we want to click. So we're going to click it. We want a new one and we can name it anything we want. I am going to name it welcome to the three out of four. And I'm going to say, okay. All right, so now I click in the body of the email and since there isn't, I can't use this paste button in Outlook for this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hold down, make sure that I'm clicked in the body here, hold down the control button and then I'm going to hit V. That pastes it in. But if you take a look, it's, it's a little squished up, but we're going to fix that. That's okay. So we're going to highlight again, just like we did in Word before, until it's all blue. And now we're going to hover our mouse anywhere within that blue s section. And we're going to right click. And up comes a pop-up menu. We're going to choose Paragraph. And in the paragraph dialog box, you see near the bottom where it says spacing and it has after, we're going to click the button, like the up button to make it say six. And that's what we want. We're going to say OK. And that fixes it. Now what's really important at this point, don't hit the OK button. See, I've highlighted it there. It's blue. If you click the OK button now, it hasn't saved your signature. You're going to have to do it all again. What you need to do is now go to the Save button. See, right now it's blue. Click that Save button, and now click the OK button. All right, so now we still don't see it. That's OK. Now we're going to go to Signature, and we see Welcome to the 3 out of 4. That's what we're going to choose, and there it is. It's ready for us to send. And let me just show you how quick it is to send another one. So I hit click a new email button, Signature, 3 out of 4. There we go. Let's see that again. New email. Signature. Welcome to the three out of four. So for every one that you want to send, it's already there. You don't have to do any more cutting and pasting. And that's all there is to it. 